Well, some of y'all might be like me, wondering who Michael West is, because right? Michael West is was, I guess, Dan Collins' like co-manager or running his stuff and that kind of stuff, helping out with production. Well, we're gonna learn more about Michael West and what he has involvement with Daniel Cohen and that kind of stuff. So let's take a look. party buses, I paid for the cars in Florida when they moved from Florida back to LA. I heavily discounted all the music videos that I produced for her, which I have yet to been paid for. Um, and I went above and beyond for Danielle. That's um, how you contract them. all sorry. the distribution for her music videos on platforms and partners that, that she has never worked with before, such as her Vivo channel, Apple Music, you know, so on and so forth. Uh, and really kind of helped her elevate Wait, so, but why are you paying for this stuff though? I don't understand. I I guess they didn't have him sign an NDA, so... Jen, um, her mother, her, Danielle had told me at one point she had $300,000 in her bank account, and then um, a couple months later had less than $10,000, which is concerning for Danielle. Um, 
and obviously I wanted to protect her because I love her and, and was there for her. Um, when I was in LA staying at Danny's house, um, we were out somewhere in Los Angeles at a mall, I believe, we're getting lunch, um, and her and her mom were in a big argument. I, again, I was feeling very uncomfortable and um, felt put in the middle because Jin would text me, what is, what is Danny doing? Danny would be, don't tell my mom anything. It made me feel very uncomfortable to say the least. Um, eventually, Danielle pulls me aside while we're out um, and tells me that she needs to talk to me and tells me her real age um, and says that if I need to, you know, do business with her, I need to know her real age, blah, blah, blah. She tells me that she is 16 years old, um, to which, you know, w was concerning because we had had this conversation about when she turns 18, what is she going to do? So she told me that she is, is 16 uh, and had just turned 16. Um, and asked me to speak to Jen so that we could get access to Danny's emails because at the time Jen was handling all of Danielle's brand deals and such um, so she had actually had me go in the room with her and her mom and I, I felt very uncomfortable uh, I kept saying this is not my place this is you know I'm here because Danielle has asked me to speak to you guys about this to which Danny cried I felt like a therapist more than a manager to say the least um, to add on uh, I just wanted to kind of give some more context into some specific things. While I was in LA with, with Jen and, and Danny, and while I was in Florida, and we were filming the documentary during Florida, I had begun to notice a pattern of behavior that was really not healthy. Um, Jen saying things like, you should wear this bikini pic, or you should post this ass pic, or you should do this, essentially pimping out her daughter. and. It made me feel very uncomfortable. I saw some really messed up photos. I think Danielle looks so cute with a nose stud. Yeah, that would be cute. But she won't do it. I already have like 12 piercings on my ears. <laughs> like I look really bad. Like I look like a cockroach. She went to get her her tongue pierced with Desiree. They were supposed to be matching, and then yeah, she wanted to get her. Well, here's yeah. the thing: is I she got, got her cartilage. When I got first. my industrial done, the lady said that, um, cause I was ready. Remember, I went up mm -hmm. there and I was like, "Oh yeah, let's get mine done now." And she was like, "No, like I don't think it's a good idea." There were times in which she would say, "Oh, if you wouldn't have aborted your daughter, you would be on 16 and pregnant." Um, I felt very, very uncomfortable. Jin would get phone calls and scream. Uh, I think we have a clip of Jin literally screaming about a lawsuit that they were getting. Um, and while I was having fun in the beginning, it became oh very God. dark and very clear that, that Jen was abusing her daughter, Danielle, which made me very concerned uh, and was a cause of action for me talking to Danielle about it and, and the reason she asked me to take over her emails and, and help out in a way so that, that Jen did not have that authority. I was concerned before I knew Danielle's real age that she was going to turn 18 next year and have nothing to her name because her mother had taken it all um, and I wanted to help her you know establish and protect herself Jen had been telling me that they had 30 CPS cases all of which I now know why um, and it, rightfully so Jen what you were doing to your daughter is not okay um, if you guys are their fans you should not allow Danielle to be treated that way by her mother and it, it's despicable the way yeah. that you could treat your own daughter, Jim. Yes, it is. Um, now, this is a whole 25-minute video, and I know you know, I'll probably want to see more information, so please go check out my home movie, Michael West, y'all. Seems like he's a very talented director, producer, and manager, so I have to give him that. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. It's only making EPG Studio. Signing out. Have a good one, and peace. See yeah. ya.